Hello watch fans, Berthier watches here and this time for you we have a circa 1955 stopwatch from Prestons of Bolton. You can see their name just at the bottom of the dial there, it, some of it has rubbed off but it's still there. Now they wouldn't have made this, they'd have had it made for them. So inside we've got the dust cover with a big thumbprint there or fingerprint And there you've got the movement. The movement is made by Vaju. It's the 320. This is sometimes known as a Hoyer 330, 340 movement. Sorry. Hoyer did make stopwatches for different people. It is entirely possible that Hoyer made this stopwatch for Preston's. We can't prove it, so it's priced like a Preston stopwatch, not a Hoyer one. You've got slide, stop, start at the side, and you've got instant restart at the top, sometimes called flyback. And then you can stop, reset. So everything's working away nicely. Dial's quite good apart from the Preston's mark. That was probably printed after the rest of the dial. It may, may explain the difference. Case is only chrome plated. There's a few little marks in the back where it's sat on its backside most of its life but it's quite sharply uh, put together the bow is still just the right condition onion crown and stopwatches would have been widely used back in the 50s if you needed to time anything you didn't reach for your phone you grabbed a stopwatch this is available now still a very cheap way to buy a chronograph and uh, it's quite nice that you've got both the 60 second dial and the decimal sub dial. So you can break it into hundredths of a second should, or hundredths of a minute should you want to. That was quite a popular thing to do, particularly with uh, efficiencies. Thanks for watching. See you again next time.